such a major issue in the United States, so I think it's important that we step back and look about how we can change this. That's why it's important that we ask, how can we change obesity? What can we do to improve the generations of today and of tomorrow? Adults and kids everywhere are becoming more and more obese day by day. Between the years 1980 and 2010, the, between the ages of 6 and 11, the number of obese children increased by 11%. The number of overweight children has also increased altogether in the past 30 years. Can you imagine being a 12-year-old boy already weighing 350 pounds? Or worse, an overweight child that's obese before even making it to kindergarten. That's why it's so important that we teach kids about eating healthy and staying active. These are some of the points that Jamie Oliver makes in his speech. Jamie Oliver is a world-renowned known chef from, from England that has been working with American schools for the past three years. He's been using his passion to teach and educate people how to eat healthy, stay active, while pushing for a change in public school meals. He's been also using his passion to give the public the tools of accessing recipes through his foundation, Better Food. For the past years, he's been working hard to change how American schools feed and educate their children, hopefully leading to a better life tomorrow. In his show, Jamie Oliver's Food Revolution, Jamie follows the life and home diets of several Americans to show how dire obesity is increasing. There are 600,000 people that die every year just from heart disease alone. That's one in every four Americans. More people die of a stroke, cancer, diabetes, or heart disease than are even murdered. So why don't people focus on make, making these life changes? As you see here, just between the years 1960 and 2004, it increased from 45% all the way up to 67%. So there's a need for concern here. A study also showed uh, five to 17 year old kids showed that 70% of the ones that were obese showed at least one risk factor of cardiovascular disease. That's why it's so important that we educate people properly. So this is where you come in. What will you do today to make sure that the kids of tomorrow are important? So do you have what it takes to make a difference? 